Hey y'all, welcome back to another episode of Aqualab 2.0. So today, just like my shirt, I have a very colorful episode for you guys. I did just get a livestock delivery that just arrived at my door. Uh, and in here I have some bumblebee dart frogs, as well as some morning geckos and some fruit flies that we're going to be putting in the vivarium downstairs. Uh, I don't want to shake this box too much and I don't want to take too long. So let's get right to it and I'm going to show you guys everything that we got going on here. All right, now here we are. Shh, you're gonna wake up the plants. So actually, first things first, I wanna spray this tank down. Just to let that settle in there. And then I'm gonna spray it again once we put everything in there. Good enough for now. All right, let's hope everything is alive. This is our fruit flies that were alive. That cat's now part of the package. Oh, they look like our froggies are alive too. Here's our first. Yellow lacmella. I'm gonna put him in the tank right here for now. Here's our second. Bumblebee frog. Here is our third. And now in here, we have our two awesome little morning geckos. So I'm going to put everything in the light here so we can get a closer look. Now I'm gonna to try to set this camera up as best as I can so that it, I don't have to hold it while I'm letting these guys go. Uh, now I wanna let you guys know I do record, produce, and edit my own videos. So please smash that subscribe button, smash that like button, and all that good stuff so I can keep producing this content for you guys. I want to let these morning geckos out last because these guys are fast. All right, so here's our first one. I'm going to name him Lucas for some reason. I'm just going to let them all figure it out on their own. Bye. 
already is here. I'm just gonna actually let go of these morning geckos because these guys are gonna hide in here. I don't think there's any here. But I do have to make sure of that. Oh, there he is. All right, now they're both in here. Oh, he's out. And he's out. And this will have to shut. I'm gonna give them some time to settle. And then we're gonna try feeding them all. So just to give a couple quick care tips while we're at it. A lot of these poison dart frogs like their temperature between 70 and 80 degrees Fahrenheit. That would be just enough for these guys. Now they are pretty flexible, but you don't want to go below 70 degrees or above 80. It's going to start to be a little bit stressful to them. Now these yellow lacamales are pretty peaceful and they don't mind being in groups, but a lot of other species can fight with each other for territory. And although it may not seem like it, they do stress each other out. They do like to eat fruit flies every day. And I'm gonna to wanna to give them at least 50 fruit flies a day each. Sometimes more, sometimes less. I also am gonna be soaking their food in vitamins. And the morning geckos is one of the few animals that can be with poison dart frogs. Again, these frogs are not poisonous because they have been bred in captivity and they eat a different food source. This guy's going for the top. Started from the bottom, now we're here. I'm gonna shut this.